Hello fellow duelists, this is Shadow of the Moon, and welcome to another two-card combo video, especially for my King Calamity Blackwing. So, um, normally when you're using King Calamity, all you would normally need is Sudri and Vata, or Sudri and Shamal, because you can always snatch the uh, latter half from your deck uh, using Sudri's effect, but to make a full optimal field using just Sudri and Black Roll and I'm actually going to be showing you today, so stay tuned. And I just want to say thank you to everybody who is subscribed to my channel and who watches my video. You guys rock. Thank you so much. It's just a privilege and an honor to be able to do these videos for everybody and just have people watch them and just comment on them and everything. So without any further ado, let's go ahead and get straight on into it. So you're going to have Sudri and Black Whirlwind. So first you're going to play Black Whirlwind. And then you're going to normal summon Sudri. You're going to activate Sudri's effect. This is going to search and Black Whirlwind's effect. So chain link one, chain link two. This is going to search for Shamal and search for Vata. So you've got both of your combo pieces. Then you're going to discard your uh, Shamal, which is going to search for your Black Feather Whirlwind. And it's going to play it. Then you're going to normal summon Vata or special summon Vata. You're going to then immediately send these two to the graveyard to synchro summon for... Notham the Starlight. So now you got Notham the Starlight. You're going to chain link one uh, Black Feather Whirlwind, or chain link one Shamal, chain link two Black Feather Whirlwind. So this is going to add Sudri back to your hand by banishing your Shamal. And this is going to special summon your Vata. Then you're going to do 800 points of damage to your opponent and also do it, drop your opponent's monster attack by 800 if they do have it. Then you're going to normal summon Sudri using Notham's effect. You're going to search again. And this time you're going to search for your Shanga, and you're going to search for Twin Shadow. All right, so go ahead, set Twin Shadow. Keep Sharanga in your hand. This is your hand right here. And then what you're going to do is you're going to Special Summon Sharanga. Then you're going to take Sudri and Vata, and you're going to Synchro Summon for Boreas Storm the Wicked Wind. Okay, you're going to activate Boreas Storm's effect. This is going to put Zephyrus the Elite into the graveyard. And then you're going to activate his effect. Bounce back Black for the Whirlwind to special summon this. You'll lose 400. Replay that. And then you're going to take these two to the grave. And you're going to Synchro Summon again for Excel Synchron Stardust Dragon. So now you have that on the field. Then you're going to activate its effect. And this is going to get you your Vata. Okay? So before you do anything else, because this is going to be very tricky, if you activate Vata's effect, obviously you're going to be locked into Dark Types. So do not activate its effect yet. Go ahead and send Excel Synchron and Sharanga to the graveyard. This is going to give you... What is that? Bestial, uh, Bestial Dispater. Okay. All right. And then what you're going to do is you're going to activate Black Feather Whirlwind's effect. You're going to have Boris Storm the Wicked Wind. You're going to special summon them back from the grave. Then you're going to activate it. Oh, wait. Actually, go ahead and send these two to the graveyard. And this is going to Synchro Summon for your Crimson Dragon. Okay, so now you got your Crimson Dragon on the field. So now you've used up your Black for the Whirlwind Special Summon. So then go ahead and Tribute Vata along with Chinook and Sudri from your deck. And this is going to Special Summon for your Black Wing Dragon. Okay, then you're going to activate Dissipator's Effect. You're going to Special Summon back your Shamal that you just had banished and then you're going to take black wing dragon and shamal the sandstorm and you're going to synchro summon for your copy of omnimar the divine thunder and then for extra and added bonus go ahead and banish your black wing dragon and your boreas storm and this is going to get you your black wing assault dragon all right so this is your opponent this is your turn right here so then what you're going to do is as soon as your opponent draws a card Go ahead, activate Crimson Dragon's effect because it is your uh, its priority. You can go ahead, activate his effect, uh, select Omnimaru, send Crimson Dragon back to the extra deck, and this is going to Synchro Summon for your King Calamity. All right, so now with King Calamity, make sure it's very important. It has to be the first. It has to be the first one to resolve. So you can chain link one Black Feather Whirlwind and then chain link two King Calamity. So go ahead and do that. Activate King Calamity's effect. And then chain link two, you can activate black or chain link one, activate black for the whirlwind. And this is going to special summon Notham the starlight back to the field. And then you can go ahead and go and use twin shadow. And twin shadow, you can shuffle back the cards into your deck for your black wing full armor master. 
So this is going to be your end board and your field and very, very good. Um, I'm just like really proud of this uh, because of how like deadly this is. I mean, you've got your burn, your opponent. This card cannot be destroyed by battle or by card effects. Or it can't be destroyed by card effects. This just dealed another 800 points of damage to your opponent. This is indestructible right now, which means the only thing that we need to get rid of is by destroying it by battle. It's unaffected. You've got your Dissipator, which is your negate for monster effect if they want to like activate an effect from the hand. And then King Calamity just completely shut down their entire turn. So, And then as a follow-up, say you draw a card. You can activate Omni Morrow's effect. Select uh, Shamal into the graveyard. And this can make this a level 4. And you send these two to the graveyard for your copy of Baron de Fleur. And then also as an added bonus, on your last turn, when you activate, when you special summon Full Armor Master, you could have banished uh, Shamal from the graveyard, and this would have given you um, Chinook back to the hand. So during that turn, so we'll reverse back for a second. So we have Omnimar on this, so say it was still your opponent's turn, and when you activated uh, Twin Shadow, you could banish uh, the uh, the uh, Shamal from your graveyard, and this will give you Chinook. So now you have a Sharnga and a Shamal into your or Sharnga in the graveyard and a Chinook in your hand. So all right, so that's gonna be it for this video. Stay tuned for the next one, which I will be showing you how to bring out Baron to floor on your turn and still go into King Calamity on your opponent's turn. So thank you with that, and I'll see you guys next time. Later.